What are Nidarians? Hey everybody! Today we are going to talk about an exciting group of aquatic animals known as Nidarians. Nidaria is a phylum that contains more than 10,000 species, all of which are found in both freshwater and saltwater environments. One of the things that makes Nidarians unique is their specialized cells called nidocytes, which they use for capturing their prey. There are five classes of Nidarians, and jellyfish are found in four of them. These classes include Anthozoa, Cyphozoa, Cubozoa, Hydrozoa, and Starozoa. Nidarians typically have a simple, typically symmetrical body shape like a bell, like a jellyfish, or they look like tubes anchored to a single spot, like coral or sea anemones. There are two types of Nidarians, swimming medusae and sessile polyps, and both have tentacles around the mouth, which have stinging cells called nidocytes to help them catch prey. Remember, nidocytes are what make Nidarians unique from other animals and what gives them their name. Nidarians are both predators and prey. Their prey ranges from plankton floating in the water to animals that can be several times larger than they are. Their predators include starfish, sea slugs, fish, and turtles. Nidarian bodies are made of mesoglia, which is a non-living jelly substance. The mesoglia is found in between two layers of epithelium, which is a covering made out of tissues, just like a sandwich. They have a single body cavity for respiration and digestion. They do not have any respiratory organs, but they absorb oxygen from the water and expel carbon dioxide. While Nidarians do not have a central nervous system, they do have a collection of neural tissue that could be a processing center. One of the most amazing things about Nidarians is their ability to regenerate. If they lose a part, it grows back. Pretty awesome. Now, you might be wondering, are jellyfish dangerous to humans? Well, jellyfish stings can be quite painful but most of the time, they only cause humans mild symptoms. However, some jellyfish can be quite hazardous to humans. The almost transparent sea wasp jelly is believed to be the most venomous of all and is responsible for almost 70% of all deadly stings yearly. Never fear, not all cnidarians are harmful to humans. Coral reefs, for example, are super important because they provide fishing grounds, protect shores from currents and tides, and are hubs for tourism. That seems pretty helpful to us. Want to try to say Nidarian three times fast? <laughs> that could be fun. But first, let's review what we have learned today. Fill in the blank. Blank reefs protect shores from currents and tides. Coral. True or false, Nidarians have a central nervous system. False. Which type of creature is found in four of the five classes of Nidarians? Jellyfish. Nice work, friends. Nidarians are fascinating creatures. The next time you see a jellyfish or a coral reef, you can share what you've learned about these amazing animals. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.